we are about to show you something pretty embarrassing. I'm done. I'm done. I quit. You, you enjoy your day out here. Oh my gosh. What? The chicken! Friends, we're about to get started on a garage cleanup. This is the messiest our garage has ever been. It's insane. Before we get started, go ahead and leave us a comment saying hello. We love hearing from you guys, so please do that and like the video. If you're on Facebook, give it a heart. And with that, let's get started. What's up, friends? Today, we are about to do something, show you something pretty embarrassing. So, we are still in the works and the talks of trying to move we haven't found a place yet. We haven't listed our house yet or are planning to sell it just right now at the moment. But with that said, we want to be prepared so when the right place comes along, we are ready to make the move and do it as fast as we can. So today we're going to be spending some time in the garage. Now, I don't even really want to show you what's behind this door because it's really embarrassing. We've done really well at keeping our house maintained. Um, it's still lived in and looks lived in throughout the day, but it's so easy to tidy and get it clean. And I'm really happy we've been in that position to be able to do that. And with that said, this area is a whole nother monster. You guys ready to see this? You ready to show them? <gasps> okay, let's go look at our garage. You gotta open the door for everybody. All right. Whoa. the record to show that this happened not on my watch <laughs> because I cleaned this garage so good I power washed the floors that's true it was clean then I guess Danielle got pregnant and this happened and I, don't come out, I don't come out of here like Daddy. this is not my I don't, Daddy, I'm to you. I don't okay the garage. I'm like John can you take this to the recycling and he opens the garage door and throws it in here okay to be fair to be fair, our recycling comes once every two weeks. Uh, it used to come every week, and then they changed it. They won't it. take it if we have a bunch. Right, and if I have a bunch of boxes beside, they won't even take it anymore. So I need to deal with that, maybe get another can or something. With that said, um, this is literally all. This is, our, this is our RV mattress, but underneath the RV mattress is just... That's a giant box of yeah, of <laughs> just recycling boxes. Oh my gosh. What? I'm done. I'm done. I quit. You, you enjoy your day out here. Oh my gosh. I didn't even know that stuff was up there. Well. What? What? The frog! The chicken! Someone shut the garage. I'm going to go grab the chickens. Echo! <laughs> and <Bert. laughs> So I spilled the grubs by trying to show you guys. Maybe they can go back. Alright, change of plans. Why? We're grabbing some chickens. Reinforcements. We're calling in reinforcements. Why are you watching for the It's not on my floor. Auntie Lena is grabbing cotton glass. Oh, come on. Oh, 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 that way. Oh. You might need to get all of them. Yeah, I'm going to go grab her. Oh, I'm going to go get all of them. While they're taking care of this, we can actually move along to what we came in here to do. Are you helping, Marin? Mary, you can clean out the car. All right, I'm gonna start getting the boxes and breaking them down. What do you want to do? <laughs> Kill me? Oh, how does it get like this, John? Look, there's a couch under there too, so that's like half of the pile. I it's know, not just even this. I'm seeing boxes of recycling. They will take at least like. I literally had two boxes that were like stacked up like that, and they didn't take them last this past week. I was literally like furious and gonna call them. So we decided to take our seats out. We were gonna rent a trailer, but I forgot my hitch is at my parents' house. Anyways, long story short, we decided just to take all the seats out back here. And we are gonna load up with some stuff to take to the dump, which is what most of that stuff is in the garage anyways. I will say this, it is gonna be nice approaching the next year with a clean slate, with the garage clean out. And I told John earlier, like, we're looking to move, we wanna move. We don't want to find the perfect property and have 30 days to like pack up, plan a move, and have to do all of this cleaning out of the garage. So that's why we're taking this week to get it done now. And 
It might hurt in the moment, but I think it's gonna feel really, really good when we're done. And it doesn't hurt that it is 70 degrees out. Uh, that's definitely making it a lot easier to knock this out. So it's not perfect yet, but we've got that all cleared out. Pretty much all the trash and, and dump stuff is out of here in the van. Actually, hold on, keep it open. So we're gonna take the trash stuff to the dump and then we have all this recycling that needs to go uh, when I get back. All right, check out what we got in here. So we got the couch in here, a um, bunch of trash bags, and then boom. Nice. Well, welcome to our third car garage. Look, this stuff has been here to like, not all of it, but a lot of it to donate or like sell, yard sell really, but now I'm gonna say donate because just forget it. Since we moved in, pretty much since we moved in. Let's hurry up so you can get this stuff to the dump. Every single one of you who's shaking your head in disgust, I'm there with you, please don't blame me. And we are back, day two. All right. I'm here. I'm ready to help. Ready to help. Ready to get. Ready to. She's leading the of charge. It. You think this is my idea? No, you think that's true. Uh, there's still. I'm just the muscle here. We did a lot, but now you said you're going to sort it out because we need to get rid. Of, okay. I'm in full on like let's purge all the things that we don't need or use. Which is all the stuff in the garage. And like, if I get in a certain <laughs> a certain mood, I can let go of a lot more. Like sometimes you're like, ah, oh, if you don't really feel it, but like I'm sick of it. And so I know this is the time to harness that because we're gonna really be able to make some tough cuts and be like, we will never use this. I thought maybe 10 years ago that we should hold on to it for a time that we would use it. And I think today's the day I'm willing to let go of those things. So well. Stay tuned, we're gonna make some piles, some donate, some trash. Those are the only two piles. We're not selling anything. We're gonna give, we're gonna give it all away. Yeah, just I give can't. it away. I think when we start thinking about we'll sell this, uh, that's when we have these humongous piles of stuff in our garage that just sits there because we don't. Somebody else we can use it more kids. than me, so I wanna bless them with it. Right, it's just easier to say, hey, you know and what? And there's a really great, uh, it's called With Love of Jesus in like, the area that our friends told us about, and we've given them things before, but they take all kinds of things and and, and they donate to people. Donate who need to it. people who need it. So. so that's what we're doing. All right, let's get to work. Let's do it. <laughs> Here's the real boss. Hi. Hey, what should we do? Should we get to work? <gasps> should we get to work? <laughs> should we clean the garage? What did you just say to <laughs> me? Were you, did you just say we need some big boxes? Do we have some big boxes? Oh I was thinking we could gosh. get one to put the... You mean like the big boxes I just discarded of yesterday? Discarded of? Disposed of, recycled. Well, I discarded them. There you go. Because they, that's what I said, oh, discarded. Discarded. Discarded, Dis discarded of. Oh, discarded, discarded of. of. Whatever. Whatever, dude. Discarded I think that's what she's talking about, the boxes that... I got rid of oh, earlier. All right. So the plan now is to got stuff for the dump in the bin. Right. We gotta make a run. We need to get everything that needs to go. It's just trash or broken, or whatever. Which we got most of it yesterday. There's just still some things like then. Then come back and load it up with things that are. Donated. Danielle's mad at me because I might have accidentally. How do you accidentally? Burn. Clearly, there was something. I made this, okay? It used to have two more pieces. It's like Glory to the Newborn King. It had two more pieces, and clearly, I. And he burned them. And then there was another one that I made. I was trying to make s'mores for the girls. I, this one that I actually loved, I just needed better nails to hold it together that I put a lot of work into. 
tuned my heart to sing by. Okay, guys, I was trying to create memories and we made s'mores. Justify it all you want. I'm not justifying it, I'm just saying that that might have been what had happened. I am sorry. How could you? Did you clean the counters? Yes. Oh dear. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay guys, we finally got this garage finished up and it's now cold outside. It was warm when we started this project and now I'm wearing a coat and it's freezing. It's like 30, 40 degrees out. I don't know. Are you ready to see the final reveal? Here we go. So we do have some things in here that still need to go. All this stuff here is stuff we are selling. Um, minus the piano, that's staying. But like this whole section from here up and over is going bye bye. And this stuff over here needs to go back in the van. So that's gonna be taken care of here um, tomorrow. And so that's pretty much that in this garage here. Let's go check out the third car garage. So this was our original like intention for this garage. This was gonna kind of keep our stuff, bikes, um, any just stuff that we aren't don't use regularly, like camping materials back here. Um, again, bikes, things like that, tools over here. This will obviously in the spring need to be arranged a little differently so we can get to the mower. But right now we just kind of these are things we aren't using right now. So what do you guys think? Did we do a good job? You know what, it's not perfect, but I'm happy with it. And it's nice to be able to walk around in here and uh, not worry about killing myself. Let me know what you think in the comments below. I just wanted to say I'm so proud of you. You can see the floor. It's pretty beautiful, isn't it? It's amazing. It's not as good as the last time when I power washed the whole floor. We'll do that in the spring. But, yeah, it's too cold for that, but it is, it feels so light because this is the first time that that garage is also clean. We can High do so five. many things. We did it. Oh, teamwork. So many activities. All right, I'm making lunch. Okay, we love you guys and we'll talk to you later. Bye. Hey, thanks so much for watching. If you want to make sure you don't miss any of our videos, click follow, follow again, and then tap see first to make sure you stay up to date on what's going on with our family.